Hello. Okay, so for the best way to um, code and test your HTML code on your Chromebook for web page design is you're going to first go to the Chrome store and you're going to do a search for carrot, C-A-R-E-T. And then you're going to get a few choices. You're going to want to scroll down. So you don't want to carrot from GitHub. You're going to scroll down until you see just carrot and it says offered by thomaswilburn.net. It says professional text editing for Chrome and Chrome OS. And you're going to add this and add app. And you're going to see that it has downloaded and successfully installed. Okay, so then when you launch the app, it's going to look like this. You're going to have an untitled text editor. Um, and then let's just say you're um, <clears throat> just typing something uh, in HTML uh, coding. So I'm just going to type hello. Um, oops, oops. Okay, so basically, now that you've typed your code, you're going to want to click File and Save File As. Okay, and then when down here where it says what your file will be saved as, you're going to want to name it something. I'm just going to name it Hello File. But the key here is you need to, um, after you name your file, you need to type .html. So you name your file, and then you type .html, and then you save it. And then when you save your file, you're going to notice that your code is going to be in different colors. Um, this is really cool because if there's an error in your co code, um, it will show up. So for example, like let's just say I forget this um, bracket here. So what happens is the code is actually going to show you the bugs. This is what's cool about a program like this instead of um, using like Notepad where you're just completely coding without any kind of guidance. Okay, so after you fix all your bugs and you run your code and you save your code, now you're going to go into your files in your Chromebook. So you're going to go into your files. Okay, and then you're better off clicking on recent. Sometimes it'll come up in um, my drive, but it's better. You're better off, off clicking recent. And then, as you can see, there's the hello file.html. All you're going to do is double click on that. And then, this is an actual live website. So, there's my code. I just typed in, I coded hello. And here it is right here. So this is what my website looks like so far. It just says hello um, with an exclamation mark. Um, so as you're editing and making your website better and improving and testing out all kinds of cool stuff, um, you can actually see what it will look like. Okay, hope that helps. Uh, if you have any more questions, email me anytime. Thank you.